Uh, I'm Adam Wilkinson, I'm the Tayside Operations Manager, I've been at Street League for just over 10 years. Uh, my name's Ali, I'm the Progressions Coordinator in Edinburgh and I've been at Street League for 8 years. Hi, my name is Lauda, I'm the London Region Operations Manager for Street League and I joined in April this year. Hi, I'm Graham, the Operations Manager for Street League in South Yorkshire. I've worked here for just over seven and a half years. I chose to work for Street League over any other organisation because of the inclusion of sports delivery. I come from an employment supporting background working with 16 to 24 neat individuals but Street League tops any other organisation. I like saying that I work for Street League because it's I'm proud to say to people oh, when people say what do you do? I'm like oh, I work for Street League, employability charity. What I enjoy most about my job uh, firstly it's seeing the young people just go through the programmes and progress that's really nice to see. I like working with young people that I feel very relatable to. So when I was younger, um, I would see myself as like an ideal street league candidate. And we work all across London with loads of young people from different cultural backgrounds, different ethnicities, different religions, different genders. And it's just absolutely fantastic to be involved in a project that works with such a large, diverse group of young people. I swear. Um that over the last 10 years I've had a great laugh like 98% of the time I've had an unbelievable laugh like every single day whether I was PC with Ali or into, into management I've had such a great time and I think that's what sets us apart you know? I think it's important for organisations like Street League to exist because not all young people suit the education system in the UK and I think it's amazing to bring in an offer that offers different types of qualifications like functional skills, maths and English, and also short courses like customer service and employability and sport to help a young person progress but outside of a school setting. That can be based on them working one-to-one -one with our coaches, but also in smaller group settings as well. I think that is different because it's fun, it's inclusive, and the young people have the opportunity to build up a really strong rapport and connection with our coaches that they might miss in a universal kind of school environment. School, I'm not going to say is failing young people at the moment, but some would say is not fit for purpose for every single young person. Um, and Street League is an option where young people can discover education again, can discover that, that learning and adults are actually alright, mm. you know, and, and, and are interested in their future. And we give them options of different things they might want to do as a career. Also, things but like even, even not even just young people, mate. Like, see, even like us as men, I've changed and grown as a person through Street League. Like, I was far more immature and silly even as an adult. But coming to Street League's helped like form me and form my character into being a better person on basically how I go and live my life and try and support these young people. So I think it's not just necessarily for young people. I think as a staff, you can grow. You're right, I've gone dreadlock when I started Street League. And uh, starting at Street League made me cut it off and I've literally never looked back. And if, if he had that, we would never have been friends. <laughs>